Are you ready for the most scrumptious gummy vitamin? These days, taking your vitamins can be sweeter than ever. A growing number of stores are stocked with gummy supplements promising to boost everything from women's health to nail strength. And they look and taste a lot like candy. The taste was just like a lot more fun and easy to eat. Even celebrities like Kourtney Kardashian Barker are getting in the game, launching her own line of gummies, promising to help users sharpen focus, de-bloat, or just relax. And the industry is booming. Global sales for gummy vitamins, nearly $7.5 billion this year, and they're predicted to reach over $13 billion in the next five years. Gummies have invaded the supplement area. But some doctors and nutritionists say, buyer beware. Gummy vitamins typically contain anywhere from 2 to 8 grams of sugar, and sugar-free gummies are not a free pass. This product might contain sugar alcohol, and consuming too much sugar alcohol at one time can cause some unpleasant GI effects for some people. The watchdog site Consumer Lab has tested hundreds of gummy vitamins. We find that there are many more quality problems with gummies than there are with tablets or capsules. The group says ingredients lose potency faster in gummy form. So in order to maintain what's promised on the label, some manufacturers may compensate by adding far more of an ingredient. When is it too much of a good thing when it comes to gummies? Any ingredient where you can get too much, like melatonin, like folic acid, like just about every vitamin out there, um, you, 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 there's a kind of a, a curve where, you know, things get better and better getting enough vitamin and then it goes worse and worse. Dietitians and doctors we spoke to say eating a variety of whole foods is still the best source of vitamins for most healthy adults. And it doesn't have to be fresh to be healthy. Canned vegetables and uh, frozen foods are your friends. But gummy vitamins can be an option for those with nutrient deficiencies or medical conditions or people who have trouble swallowing pills. How can a consumer figure out which gummy vitamin they can trust. Well, as for all dietary supplements, consumers should look for trusted brands from reputable retailers. Experts say look for the USP or NSF label, which is a third party seal ensuring the product has been vetted. And always consult a doctor before adding vitamins and supplements to your diet. Advice worth chewing on. And one more tip. Experts say pay attention to the recommended dose, especially when it comes to kids' gummies. We know they're yummy, but you want to stick to what's on the label. We also reached out to Courtney Kardashian Barker's brand, Lemmy, for comment, but we did not hear back. So, Vic, when should folks even consider, like, taking vitamins, period? Look, the key here is if you have a condition that makes it hard for you to absorb vitamins and nutrients from your actual food, like mm -hmm. Crohn's disease, sure, or if you're pregnant or nursing, or maybe you eat a very restrictive diet. Mm -hmm. But the doctors say, listen, if you eat from a variety of mm -hmm. foods, eat the rainbow, add some beans, some whole grains to your diet. Most Americans do not need any vitamins or supplements of any kind. Right. Gummy, chewable pills, none. Thank you, Vicky. You did not get a haircut, right? No, this <laughs> okay. is Laura's work. Thank you. Uh -huh. Looks good on you. <laughs> All right. Hey, thanks for watching. Don't miss the Today Show every weekday at 11 a.m. Eastern, 8 Pacific, on our streaming channel, Today All Day. To watch, head to today.com slash all day or Click the link right here.